Now, a disappointing night for Gator fans, but business is still booming as Georgia fans celebrate through the night. RV City has been packed all week, gearing up for the annual SEC rivalry game. Sky 4 gave us this aerial view of Everbank Field as gates opened this afternoon and fans made their way into the stadium. Many frustrated Florida fans, however, left early. Georgia fans celebrating a huge win tonight, beating the Gators 42-7, to and many of them staying the extra night to celebrate. Channel 4's Destiny McKeever found out this year's game is sure to bring in millions in revenue. It's a game that brings out hundreds of thousands of people in Jacksonville. For over 80 consecutive years, Jacksonville has hosted the Florida-Georgia game. Each year, economic impact shows the game is a huge win for the city. In 2015, business sales in Jacksonville during Florida-Georgia weekend were $35 million, with total visitors at 130,000. In previous years, Mayor Lenny Curry has called the event beneficial in making Jacksonville a leading destination for major events it definitely helps I mean it gets people here look at I mean when was the landing this busy ever <laughs> like maybe twice a year so it helps Jacksonville for sure I, I like I said I went to the University of Alabama we brought in hundred and eighty four million dollars last year just in football in general I think this place just for the game this year literally probably brought in I, I will say ten million dollars easy there's no there's no doubt in my mind that that happened so And that was Destiny McKeever reporting. Last year, the annual showdown brought in an estimated $70 million to Jacksonville. Cole Pepper will have highlights from the game coming up in sports.